It's VHS X. What do you mean? All right, everybody, welcome back. We are doing a post commentary today. Um, unfortunately, my headset is not really working, so I can't really uh, record and play at the same time because um, I can't actually hear um, the, the game audio, but um, we will be getting a new uh, mic in the coming weeks. So um, I know a lot of you guys must be very uh, glad to hear that because I know the mic is not the, uh, not the best that we have right now. But um, we just have to wait a little bit. You know how delivery times are, unfortunately. So uh, we do what we got to do. Um, with that being said, I've been um, under the weather lately, so um, it has been a little bit difficult to actually make some videos, but I decided to at least get in here, and uh, apologies if I don't sound as energetic, you know, once again, been under the weather, so, you know, you know, we can't be really chilling and killing as we normally do, so we have to kind of <laughs> do what we can. Uh, with that being said, let's get a, let's get a, well, let's go ahead Zarina, right? Um, now it is the game, they did send us here, so, uh, it's annoying that we have to go from pallet to pallet. Um, but uh, we're just gonna do what we can. They, they actually didn't go to the God Palette, which is weird. Now, here's something that you guys may like here. You see what I'm doing here? We're just listening to the wall, then we go back around, because you know Goofball was gonna try to think, oh, he doesn't see me, I'm gonna walk the other way. No, you're not. I already, I already knew they were gonna do some goof, goofy stuff like that, you know? And that's that comes with game awareness, you know? Um, because I figured, like, this is something I also do as Ghostface. If I break line of sight, I'm usually trying to mind game uh, which direction I'm about to go to. Um, and that's something that you, you should probably pick up if you are a, a killer player. It's definitely try to be unpredictable. Don't uh, do things they expect, usually. Um, and especially if a character like Ghostface, I, I try to really try to throw them off as much as I can in any way I can. So, um... That being said, I actually had Jolt originally on this build, but I decided to swap it for Dead Man Switch because it seems like Jolt can actually make the gens get blocked uh, a lot sooner. Okay, because you get about eight kicks on a gen, essentially eight you know explosions on a gen. Um, that excludes skill checks, um, but you will only get a maximum of eight damages on a gen before it blocks. So if you're if I'm using Surge and I'm blasting a gen like a bunch of times it's, it's inevitably it's gonna stop progressing because of the whole you know mechanic that's that's there and jolt does i mean if you get eight downs in the gen it's like it's it's not even gonna it's not gonna let you uh regress it anymore now i guess in the, another scenario another perspective um which i actually did trade out the hook here for more pain res because i wanted to actually utilize pain res and dead man's actually getting me value um which i did fumble there um, which is fine. <laughs> Hadn't played Legion in a little bit. And I actually went for the friendship bracelet, and I think that's what made the lunge so long, which kind of threw me off there. Um, but that's fine. Now, obviously, um, we are utilizing... Well, we don't really have to utilize the strategies here, mainly because um, I wanted to get the pain res hooks out first and just blow up the same gen, or whichever gen, a couple times, just to create uh, the maximum amount of slowdown at the start of the game, because I figure that is where... <coughs> You are the strongest. Um, even though people say that at the start of the game, you are the weakest, I would want to be, you know, you, exactly. <laughs> exactly my point is uh, <clears throat> you knock out those pain reses early, and then, then they start giving up, which is even more funny to me. Um, and that help, uh, that'll get the, the game to your side <laughs> a lot sooner. Um, now, that leaves Fang there with second state, so she's going to probably get killed if she gets downed again which probably won't take long um and i uh yeah i mean legion is definitely one of my mains uh very fun i would say but we knock out the pain reses early just for that um also yeah obviously be unpredictable with when you're playing killer and whatnot and i think that's another reason why i value freddy as, a, as a, one of my mains so highly is because with freddy it's unexpected a lot of the times we do throw people off with what you're able, which you're able to um, pull out, because there's a couple of, of different things that go into that. But I'll cover all that in a, in a definitive, like Freddy, uh, like oh, I'll j like a whole like stream for you guys. I'm gonna actually cover that all the Freddy nooks and all the Freddy whatever. What the heck? All the all the aspects of Freddy. Now we do have both of them on the screen here, which is great for me. That I actually had to make the third person get off the gen and go for the save. 
which ultimately um, I would want to intercept, but that's completely fine because we do just want to use our power. That makes the rest of them scatter, but that also would mean that they can't body block. So what I decided to do is just cancel here. She has nowhere to go pretty much, so she decides to go down. So that works out for me. And then we get her out the game. Um, and, and that's the type of thing, the type of awareness you need to be on. You know, I know a lot of people um, may, you know, may see Legion as weak. Um, which, in reality, I think he's probably kind of like a little bit like Deathslinger, where um, getting that first hit is going to be so easy to do. Getting that second down, like second hit to down them, may be something else completely. Um, but this is, but you know, he's, he's he's quite useful, Legion. I mean, honestly, you you know, the Legion, I should say. Now, it can be a little bit tricky. We did actually get both of them out of the game because he did start quitting because the first gen didn't even go off yet, so that was just great. Um, so we're literally down to two people at four gens. I would say it's a really solid build. We do hear them healing here. Um, and that's why we had gone for the hit there. And then we attempt to go after the other one uh, to try to get them, uh, get them a hit as well. She drops the pallet, that's cool. And then you can just go ahead and vault it and then go after her. But we didn't have enough duration, which sucks. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, I'm gonna probably try to drop uh, that Freddy video, like that stream, like probably in the coming weeks, because I won't be able to actually hear the game. Um, and like I can't like live stream it <clears throat> for you guys because I won't be able to hear the hear the actual game while recording the mic with the microphone unless you want to hear an even worse sounding mic um, than this one uh, on stream. <laughs> so it's not gonna be uh, it's not gonna be enjoyable, but you know it's 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 fine, right? You know. I'll, I'll try to figure it out. We just have to wait it out. You know what I'm saying? It does take a little while for things to get delivered, unfortunately. So, um, and in this portion of the video, they are actually going to run from pallet to pallet. So we are just going to go ahead and skip ahead. So now we go ahead and we find uh, the cape here. We just go ahead and make her bend. I'm going to actually block the vault. I think she kind of just gives up. <laughs> oh, man. She gave up, which is really, really funny. And then we actually go ahead and kick the thing. I don't know why they think they're gonna get the gen done. That's not gonna happen. Um, and then we just go ahead and find uh, where Zarina is, which I think it's the, I think it's the same nonsense, which is like running from pallet to pallet. So we might cut that again. Um, well, actually, actually, we find them here. That's cool. Um, yeah, I mean, it's already the end of the game. Yep, pallet. Yeah, that's one. Why don't we play the pallet game where we count each and every one of them that we pass by? This is already the second one. I'm gonna try to activate Frenzy again just for some more points, you know, and it'll, it'll make them want to drop. Yeah, this one likes to pretend they're mind gaming. Like, buddy, nobody, nobody, <laughs> nobody's falling for that. Like, come on, bro. And then they just dropped it regardless, so then we just go ahead and break it again. That's already two. Um, and obviously I'm going for my blood points here, you know what I'm saying? We are leveling up Legion a little bit. Now we are very close to P100. Well, I wouldn't say very close, but we're getting to P100 like, here like soon, I would think. And in my, in my, <clears throat> my honest opinion, I think we're getting there. Um, because we are at, what, P81 or 82, I believe? So we're very close here. And I would say like my, my footwork is definitely solid here. I did get stuck on the wall. <laughs> oh man, that's unfortunate. I was, oh, what the heck? I didn't reach that even with, even with the speed boost. I didn't even get the lunge on it. Hey, I mean, if they, I don't know if they meant to fly in there, but I'll take it, man. I'm glad that, that, uh, that I didn't break the pallet. Because then we got this goofball to get on the hook. Um, but that's nice, I would say. Cool. I also made sure not to uh, close the hatch until they bled out. I was not at the time of me playing the, this match. I just was. I did not feel like trying to find them at the gate. It was a. It, you know, it, it's a lot of work, man. Which uh, she didn't have adrenaline, but let's get into the next one. This is actually a game that that I actually played right when the update dropped. Um, and uh, once again, I really hope you guys are enjoying the Legion gameplay. Um, I know it's not the conventional like usually like how I normally. We'll record these, but unfortunately, due to like obviously some unforeseen circumstances, due to like my mic, like kind of just like just dying, you know what I'm saying, um, or my headset or whatever have you, uh, getting getting sick, you know, like it was just a lot of things that just happened all at once. So I was like, man, like this is just gonna really, and then obviously the delivery time, we're actually getting the headset, it just it really, it really just puts a <laughs> puts a 
a bit of a bad, uh, what do you call it? It's a bad situation, but we're making, we're gonna make it work. Um, we do actually, <laughs> I think I had to step away from the game for a second, so I just cut that pause out, but yeah, like, I think the Nick was, like, still there, I think, so I was just, like, I might as well just follow him, you know? I had a challenge for getting 15 frenzy hits in this match, so, um, I went for Never Sleep, you know, Mural Sketch. I know it's not the most, like, S-tier, you know, combination, but it works for me because I like actually using my power. Um, and I, it's really unfortunate. I had a, I had a really close game that, um that I wanted to post, but then I, I, I don't know if it got deleted or just never got recorded or something, but if I do end up finding it, um, then it obviously will be posted. If I don't, maybe it got deleted, then uh, then we just kind of have to, you know, just kind of let that go, I guess, you know, it's fine. Um, with that being said, oh, this guy, this guy thinks he's got jokes, okay? He thinks he thinks flying into, into lockers is his big play and free dropping like a clown. Um, which this, I think this guy was the, I think he was a guy that sent a message to me. I might have deleted that as well. I'm not entirely sure. Um, but he was really butthurt about, about Legion. And I was like, you know, the usual, like, just don't get down then, forehead. Like, stop, <laughs> stop being a, being a clown. Now, obviously, we're still at the first, you know, hit of, barely at the first hit of friends. So this guy thinks he's got jokes. So I was just gonna wait him out, you know what I'm saying? And when I got close to the, to the locker, you know what I'm saying? There's a way to round it. Um, but having never sleep fills and it does make the durations like at least 20 seconds long or so, which gives me plenty of time to actually get to the next person and not have to worry about duration. So it really makes it very chill to play Legion, um, which is nice, I would say. Um, and I would say, I think I'm doing pretty well. Like, also by the time, like, it's really cool because you can get a hit with Frenzy and then by the time you actually uh, get to the... Damn, he, like, literally outran me. All right, fine. Um, that's interesting. Now, this isn't, like, my favorite map at all. It kind of, I think it kind of sucks, but, you know, we, we, we still got to work what we got. Now, this is where I, I started figuring out the mechanics of, the, like, the new gen kick mechanic because obviously we got the five percent on that gen you notice they're gonna close in so we try to use frenzy again we are moving at pretty much walking speed while looking like we're running which does drive a lot of fear into them even though they don't realize how slow i'm actually moving we do actually mind game it there which is good on my part we get the free hit we know they're gonna go ahead and try to greed that gen which is why we run back with a slight increase in speed by the time you get the second hit you're moving pretty much at normal speed um, but which is kind of what I like about it. You're moving at normal speed while having a long duration so you can just kind of get to your destination. Now unfortunately because of how long it takes to actually run from point A to point B, even on a big map like this, um, which is the whole point of me even running Never Sleep uh, with Mural Sketch, is to try to counteract the gigantic maps that we have in this game, which are a lot of them. And it's what makes Legion kind of, you know, not be really able to chain a lot of hits, which is... Uh, just a detriment to to playing them unfor to playing them unfortunately. Um, we act like we don't see him, and then we get some surge value. So mind you, um, we only get about eight kicks on a gen or eight explosions on a gen. That includes pain res, jolts, etc., um, or kicking it. You only get about eight of them. So uh, and then it'll, it'll get blocked. Now that can be a problem if you are down in the next to the same gen the entire time. Um, because then you obviously can't stop the gen from regressing any more than that, and if you're down to like one gen, you know, then it can be a bit of a problem. Now thankfully because a lot of survivors, uh, love just trying to stun you with the pallet and keep missing it, it does give you time to do that. And then you also go ahead and kick the gen in the meantime, um, so that while they're mending it will regress a little bit, which is really good, and we still have enough time to actually reach our next target. Which I think is the same clown over here that keeps trying to hide in lockers and stuff, and vaulting into me just gives you the hit I need, so. He really thought he was some kind of genius, but still gave me everything I needed, so. The gen is still regressing. Um, and I really should play more Legion. Legion has some pretty interesting add-ons, and I do want to see if I can create some builds around it. Um, for the fun aspect. Now we do get a nice hit on them. I want to go around the pallet just in case I somehow got sucked into the stun. I, I waited there, because I'm like, he really thinks he's going to FOV tech me. Like, that's not how it works. Um, I think all we need now is to get, like, a, that, uh, get David or somebody else, which is what we wanted for our last hit. Um, which we normally don't get these unless we're actively running uh, Never Sleep with Mural Sketch on a big map. Um, 
Which is honestly what I just want to do. I just want those downs, man. I want to actually enjoy the character. <laughs> um, this one's on the Jets, um, but that's fine. We should be able to, like, fly over. Which I'm pretty sure that's an Alan Wake character. If you guys want to see me play Alan Wake, man, definitely leave a comment. Um, I know I haven't actually completed my Walking Dead playthroughs, so maybe I'll try to post up those in the future. Um, you know, because my mic will, you know, obviously, you know, not be what I'm using right now. It hopefully will be a lot better. Um, and we actually want to go after Nicolas Cage here because uh, we can actually get a... I somehow didn't get the swing there. I don't know what's wrong with the game, but fine. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and break this pallet. I, don't, I really... I don't, I don't know why that didn't really land. I don't know. I couldn't even see what happened there, but... Hopefully by the time this thing recharges, it should be all right. Oh, there goes the, the clown again, yeah. It's usually the Allen players that are using for the most clowny. I'm going to actually, actually activate my power again, so... We're going to look that way, get him to vault. Yup, stupid. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, I, I try to do mind games even in Frenzy, man. Especially when you want to have the duration. It just makes it that more enjoyable to, to go for it. Now, I'm actually going to ignore Nick over here because I see that they're both like trying to stick to Jen really hard. So I was like, at least let me go for uh, the David again. He, he, he does end up getting the stun, which is fine. I was actually just trying to... Uh, at least get one of them to men to get them off the gen, and then the other one is gonna try to bum rush it again. We're gonna kick it again. And we try to hold back this gen as much as we can. Um, because we have a decent gen spread. Um, unfortunately, due to the, obviously the whole gen kicking and, you know, gen regression changes, it does make it a little bit more difficult. They're, they're really like trying to bum rush that gen. It's really hard. I, I don't, I never understood why. Um, because there's other gens that are being worked on as well, so. I figured they could have been trying to just switch and go to a different one instead and apply pressure that way, but they just didn't. So David's like, I'm gonna try to look that way, get him to fall. Yup, 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 yup. That little, that little like buckle, that little hesitation is exactly what we, what I needed there. That was awesome. Really solid on my part, I will say. Now this one, this Nick, I don't, I don't think he's gonna. Yeah, he's gonna end up getting frenzy. Yeah, he gets it there. And I think I'm able to actually go back over because they're once again trying to stack on the gen. So we're once again gonna go after her. Um, which we're moving at a pretty good speed here. Um, and we have enough duration, so... We actually get the, the, the fourth, and then we can actually get the fifth on her, which is really good. Another great thing about the, about the add-ons, too, is that it actually gives you a lot more blood points. Um, you know, a lot quicker, um, because of the bonus you get for using it, which is really cool. Um, especially if you want to get P100 Legion. Um, that will make that a lot easier to do so. Um, which is cool. Now we got Jolt on the, uh, I mean, Pain Res on the gen. Uh, on that same gen again, so I don't really remember how many how many explosions that was, but it uh, it does eventually start to get blocked. Um, now, of course, the sage over here is uh, getting I think that's what that says, saga I think, whatever the the they they they're definitely getting mad I guess uh, at at the power of legion I understand, um, but I really don't at the same time. Um, either way, they're get they're getting pretty. It seems like they're getting pretty pissed, so it seems like it's working out. Yep, yep, she's mad. I'm like, oh, I'll take the, uh, let me just get my extra, uh, extra frenzy hit just to knock off that endurance real quick. And then I'll just get the M1. <laughs> and then we got Surge to blow up another gen, which is really good, too. Um, yeah, and then we just put him right there. Nice. So we got the, uh, we got a kill, which is awesome. It can be a little bit tricky with Legion to kind of, uh, know when to, uh, when to use your power and when to run away and when to cancel, but, uh, Having this uh, really does help, you know. Having the uh, having the having the add-ons really does make it a lot easier. I'm hoping to try to find some more people to get some more frenzy in, but uh, it doesn't seem like there really is anyone else. So I figured I'll just go right back to Nicholas over here. It doesn't seem like he knows um, what he's doing. So I'm gonna cancel here so he can't uh, run back. Now here he thinks he's got some kind of mind games. I'm gonna push him around that way anyway, just because I knew he was gonna do something dumb, which is obviously trying to run to that other window. I'm like, that's probably not your best play. Um, I guess he figured I would mind game at that time, and that's sort of the conditioning you put them under when you're being unpredictable, which got him killed. As you can see, now the now the entity's starting to block the gen. Um, I don't know if that was the maximum amount of explosions in the gen or not. Um, but either way, that is two kills already. And then, uh, I'm gonna hopefully, hopefully we can get some more rage in the DMs, uh, for Legion. And sorry, because I wanted to create the playlist for it. 
have all the videos all encompassed in one one spot and uh and just see what we do you know to see what we can do with, with that maybe we can try to get every killer uh if, if it's possible hopefully get like raids into dms for every every killer in the game you know possibly right? <laughs> It, it, I think it, it takes a little bit of time, but it does work. Now, once again, this guy thinks he's got jokes. You know what I'm saying? It's got to be one of them. So I'm just going to go ahead and just pull him out. I, I mean, they, they can... they can. I don't know why he thought... I don't know why he thought... I... I oh, boy. I don't know why he thought that putting a flashbang behind... I mean, then again, that just goes to show, like, flashbangs are that just ridiculous that they honestly believe in their minds they actually can uh pl like place it behind you even when you're pulling them out of blockers i still find that ridiculous which i mean mind you like flashbangs are that free where they're really able to just drop them behind you and there's nothing you can do about it um which i find very ridiculous but Thankfully, because it, like they changed it, so you can't get really good. But I don't know why he's wasting so much time dropping flashbangs. Maybe that's why he got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now he starts with the pointing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got. He got mad. He got mad. He's not getting. He's not blinding anybody. So oh, what the heck? I'm running my perk. What the f? Like I can't use it. I'm like yeah. Like come on, bro. Come on, man. This is pathetic. Like come on, bro. Are you gonna catch a tantrum because he can't use your flashbang? Like how about get better? <laughs> Come on, man. I think I don't know what survivors think the killers are there for their entertainment or something. That's not how it works, man. It's not how it works. Not how it works. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm here to play the game too. I'm not here to entertain. I'm only here to entertain you guys. Like you guys watching the video. I'm not here to entertain you guys. Which I hope. <laughs> oh, and now this clown thinks we're friends. Stop. Like, come on, buddy. Like, have some self-respect. Like, come on, man. So I'm, I'm going to go ahead and uh, see if I can show a little bit of the message at the end, but I don't, I don't know if I even have it anymore. <laughs> well, that is the end of the video for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I could, I just, I think I ended up deleting the screenshot. Um, but with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and you're enjoying the gameplay and whatnot. Hopefully the commentary is not too boring. Um, I, I just, you know, I'm trying my best here, <laughs> uh, being under the weather and all. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll hopefully I'll see you in the next one.